Hashtag amazing grade for a little scientist. I'm Teacher V, your scientific buddy. Are you ready to learn? Let's go! For quarter one, week seven, identify changes in materials, whether useful or harmful to one's environment. Part two. Can you still remember our lesson last week? Let's have a short recap of our past lesson. Looking back, identify whether the following changes are useful or harmful to the environment. Cutting of trees. Is it A, useful, or B, harmful? The correct answer is B. Harmful. Good job! Plastic containers as planters. Is it A. Useful or B. Harmful? The correct answer is A. Useful. You got it right! Dumping of garbage to bodies of water. Is it A, useful, or B, harmful? The correct answer is B, harmful. Very good! Smoking. Is it A, useful, or B, harmful? The correct answer is B. Harmful. Good job! Planting. Is it A. Useful or B. Harmful? The correct answer is A. Useful. Wow! Amazing! Analyze what changes you can do to make the materials useful and harmful to the environment. 3. Useful. Cutting wood for chairs. Harmful. Deforestation that can cause flooding. Plastic bottles. Useful. Recycling plastic bottles into a flower pot. Harmful. Burning of plastic bottles can cause lung diseases. Tin cans. Useful. Recycling tin can into pen or pencil holder. Harmful. Throwing them to the bodies of water may threaten the lives of aquatic animals. Dried leaves. Useful. Composting dried leaves to make it an organic fertilizer for plants. Harmful. Burning of dried leaves may contribute to the continuous depletion of the ozone layer. We cannot avoid the harmful effects of changes in the environment, but we can minimize it. There are five R's of responsible waste management. We have reduce, reuse, recycle, repair, and rot. Reduce. Buy items in refillable containers. Use cloth bag or echo bag or paper bag or native baskets instead of plastic bag when you buy groceries. Avoid buying disposable items or single-use products such as batteries, razors, utensils, plates, cups, and many more. Reuse. Donate or sell reusable items. 
Use both sides of paper when printing and reuse as scratch paper or gift wrapper or many more. Buy durable food or storage containers and reuse them instead of using foil and plastic bags or wrap. Recycle Do not throw away used newspapers or used writing pads. Sell them or bring them to paper mills which can turn them into usable paper again. Used bottle, bottles, tin cans, and rubber tiles can be recycled into useful materials. Repair Have appliances, office equipment, lightning fixtures, and automotive parts repaired instead of buying new ones. Have an old furniture reupholstered or refurbished instead of buying new ones. Rot. Set up a compost pile to compost your yard trimmings. Make a compost pit or bin in the yard for your biodegradable materials such as fruits, vegetables, coffee greens, and many more. Now, let's try! Identify which waste management is being described by the following situations. Number 1. Anna made a pencil holder out of tin can. Is it A. Reduce B. Reuse C. Recycle D. Repair or E. Rot. The correct answer is C. Recycle. Very good. Number two. Your mom uses refillable containers. A. Reduce. B. Reuse. C. Recycle. D. Repair. E. Rot. The correct answer is B. Reuse. Good job! Number 3. Your family sets up a compost pit in your backyard. Is it A. Reduce. B. Reuse. C. Recycle. D. Repair. Or E. Rot. The correct answer is E. Rot. Wow! Amazing! Number 4. Your mom is using an echo bag when going to the grocery. A. Reduce. B. Reuse. C. Recycle. D. Repair. E. Rot. The correct answer is A. Reduce. Wow! You got it right! Number 5. Your dad is fixing your study table instead of buying a new one. Is it A. Reduce. B. Reuse. C. Recycle. D. Repair. E. Rot. The correct answer is D. Repair. Well done. Don't forget to finish your offline task for this week. If you are new to my channel, please click the subscribe button and the notification bell to keep you updated. See you next video.